Hi everybody, I'm Mike, and this is the Daily Challenge for December 19th, 2013. Let's go challenge ourselves on this day of the 19th of December. Or some such thing. Quite. So, I was watching the NLSS, which is the Northern Lions Super Show, and they were just about to start the Spunky Daily Challenge, and I was like, oh wait, I should go record my Daily Challenge so I don't see their Daily, well, them doing the Daily, so I don't get a sneak peek as to what's going to happen in the Daily. So, here I am, recording the Daily. What's up, guys? How you doing? I hope you're doing well. I'm doing okay. Breaking all sorts of stuff. Don't 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 interpret that as, as some sort of as some sort of anger. It's not. I'm I'm actually in a fantastic mood. Uh, recorded a little bit of Stanley Parable earlier today. Recorded some amnesia, which is good. Got all my stuff out of the way. I just have to to do some other chores and stuff like that um, today. Maybe bake some cookies? Yeah. You're gonna go all Martha Stewart on your ass? Um, and... Yeah. Got my out-of-town friends. Well, they're already in town, but they are gonna come and hang out with me tomorrow in the morning. So, that's going to be a thing. I'm looking forward to that. And actually, right after I'm done recording the daily, I'm going to go hang out with Omnimus69. Well, I'm not going to go actually hang out with him. Uh, we're going to hang out via the Skypes. Um, but, it's going to be nice talking to him and shooting the breeze. So I'm looking forward to that as well. And yeah, everything's gravy. Man, there is... Ooh! That there. Mmm! Really want to go and... You know what? I want to buy a bomb box. But I also really want to buy paste. And I'm pretty sure I can do both if I bomb my way into here and grab this stuff. Huh. Looks like it can... Whoa, whoa, looks like it can also grab Doug the Pug if I do that. So... Maybe I'll just go ahead and do that then. And that'll be a thing that happened. So, I'll buy paste. And I'll buy a bomb box. And I'll buy a bomb bag. And then we'll have, like, 17 bombs and some paste, and everybody will be happy. Well, except for people who don't want me to do well, but screw them, because... Well, do I really need to give a reason why I should say screw them? <laughs> okay, so we're going to try the whip trick. Didn't work! Couldn't turn around in time! Ropes. Alright. There we go. Oh, Cobra, how I hate you. Uh, little known fact, I'm actually a, um, a former member of G.I. Joe. And that's why I hate Cobra so much. Cobra Commander actually killed some of my best friends in the, um, the, uh, J Joe Wars of 
20, 20, 25. Casey had... Oh, I didn't even have to do that. I had paste. Why do I do that then? In case you couldn't already tell, I, uh, I like to talk. And, uh, that's part of ooh, how I, um, ended up, you know, doing this as a hobby. <laughs> ooh, that was really close. Hmm. I wonder... Oh, I can just jump up here. Well, isn't that convenient? I'm gonna go grab your... Poochie behind that. That made it sound like I'm gonna sexually harass my dog. <laughs> I'm... I'm- I'm not going to do that. Please, please, please don't... Please, please don't call any authorities. I- I'm not a... Not a pooch behind grabber. Um, at least not in any sort of inappropriate way. Not that there's any appropriate way in which to... That was dumb! I should've started whipping before. Not that I'd whip the pooch. I... I'm just gonna be quiet. I'm, let's just leave the level. Or, you know, I could've thrown Doug up there and he could've taken the brunt of that for me, but, um... Again? I'm not very bright. And you know what? I'm not I'm not even gonna grab that gem. Don't don't even care. We're gonna go. That probably was not the best idea I've ever had. But it definitely wasn't the worst. I'm just going to have to deal with shopkeepers from now on, and that'll be a thing that is going on. Um, hmm. Oh, hey! Ropes! Why can't I hold all these ropes? Um... because they're not in a crate anymore. Um, so, yeah, there we go. We want to kill that bed. Now, why? Why is it that I feel bad about killing, like, if I shoot Douglas in this game, or Douglas falls on spikes, or, or something something terrible like that. Why is it that I feel bad about him dying? But I don't feel bad about shooting a giant spider, or a, or a bat, or something. What? Why is that? I, I, I mean, I'm sure there are people who don't feel that way, but the vast majority of... English. I don't speak it very well. Um, the vast majority of... Majority. Why am I have? I've never had problems saying majority in my life. The vast majority of us don't feel bad, you know, if a, a, a bat is killed. Like, if you had a bat in your house right now, you'd probably be freaking out. Even if you like bats. Um, but... Oh, teleporter. Yay. I want that. Um, but yeah, you know, it, it, even if you like bats, m most people would would rather see a bat killed than, like, a pooch. And I wonder... well, it's probably because of the domestication. Yeah, you know, actually, that's... I think I've just answered my own question. Alright, good talk, self. Why... why... why did you drop... 
with a shotgun in into Why did you drop the shotgun into the, the, the water thing, Mike? That wasn't very smart. Neither was just calling it a water thing. Um... Hmm. Let's put the shotgun here so we don't lose it in this tree. We're gonna grab this guy. And then... Uh, unsuccessfully throw him across. Then we're gonna leave him in there, because we don't really care that much. A medic! Hmm. Actually, you know what? Might be thinking to yourself, no. What? Um, I'm going to use this to get through to Douglas, provided he doesn't you know, spike himself. Um, there we go. Or get killed. He's probably gonna get killed by that. Terrible, terrible cobra. Haha, uh. <laughs> not a not on my watch, cobra. Alright. Yeah, my, my code name when I was in G.I. Joe was um was um was red shirt. I will pay for my crumbs. A terrible chill also runs up my spine. Um, also... It has... Wow! Take all the stupid damage, Mike! All of it! All of it! I guess I could've stuck around um, to deal with the ghost and, and go get Douglas, but... I, uh, sort of panicked when I saw the ghost, so... Judge me if you're gonna, but... Uh, uh, well, I guess just judge me if you're gonna. <laughs> um... Alright. I wonder how it's gonna be recording videos when I have, like... A live studio audience. I've never really done that before. I know that I had a, a hard time bringing myself to record videos in the beginning because I thought that talking to myself and recording it was kind of weird. Like before I, I, I posted my first video on YouTube, um, oh man, this is, this is bad. Before I posted my... Oh, man, that was stupid. Um... Just to finish my thought, the... Before I posted my first video on YouTube, I actually recorded probably about... Somewhere between half a dozen and a dozen videos. And edited them and stuff like that, and just gotten rid of them. Because I thought it was stupid, or it sounded stupid, or I didn't like the sound of my recorded voice, or whatever. Until I finally got, you know, the co the cojones to actually put one up on the on the intertubes and do it. So I wonder how it's going to be, even though, I mean, I'm very, very comfortable with my friends, you know, who are going to be here, and, and they're, they're great supporters of mine. But um, let's move over to the leaderboards, because that's irritating. Um, yeah, my friends that are going to be here are great, great supporters of, of me and, and my hobby and, and, and the channel. Um, I wonder how it's going to be talking with the other people in the room and not talking to them, but talking to, I mean, you guys, and I guess to myself. I wonder how that's going to be. That's going to be weird. Anyway, um, so what, yeah, what I intended to do, the, 
the reason why I died there is obviously because I blew myself up because I'm a big idiot, but there was a method be behind my madness. What I was trying to do was I was trying to put that sneaky bomb down, pick it up, and then hang over the edge, and then drop it down. Um, but I haven't perfected that, obviously. <laughs> so I just ended up blowing my ass up. Um, so that was the thing. Maybe next time we won't do that? Maybe next time I'll just drop on the shopkeeper and walk my way out the door or something different? But, I don't know, I figured that I would try something different. And hopefully there was... Yeah, much fail. So disappoint. Yeah. Um... Hopefully it was entertaining to you guys, at least, a little bit. <laughs> or at least to give you a, wait, what, what is he doing? <laughs> why, are you, why are you doing this? Um, anyway, uh, if you like this episode, or you just want to support the series, feel free to go ahead and click on that good old thumbs up button. Um, if you uh, haven't subscribed and you feel like that's something you may want to do, that button's down there as well. If you uh, have any positive or negative feedback, or you just want to post your score, either to chart your progress alongside of mine, or just to show off that you're a better small key player than I am, which, you know, probably shouldn't be that hard, um, feel free to, you know, post your score in the uh, in the comment section. Uh, if you want to join me on Facebook or on Steam, you can do that by clicking on one of the links in the description, and it'll bring you to right where you need to go. Uh, but I have been Mike, and you have been you, and this has been the Spelunky Daily Challenge for December 19th, 2013. Um, I'd like to thank you all very much for watching, and we'll catch you in the next one. Um, with an audience! So, that'll be weird. So, if tomorrow's video's weird... Sorry? <laughs> Bye-bye.